Luke chapter 24, verse 1 to 28, King James Version. Now, upon the first day of the week, very early in the morning, they came unto the sepulchre, bringing the spices which they had prepared, and certain others with them. And they found the stone, rolled away from the sepulchre, and they entered in, and found not the body of the Lord Jesus. And it came to pass, as they were much perplexed thereabout. Behold, two men stood by them in shining garments, and as they were afraid, and bowed down their faces to the earth, they said unto them, Why seek ye the living among the dead? He is not here, but is risen. Remember how he spake unto you when he was yet in Galilee, saying, The Son of Man must be delivered into the hands of sinful men and be crucified, and the third day rise again. And they remembered his words and returned from the sepulchre and told all these things unto the eleven, and to all the rest. It was Mary Magdalene and Joanna, and Mary, the mother of James, and the other women that were with them, which told these things unto the apostles. And their words seemed to them as idle tales, and they believed them not. Then arose Peter, and ran unto the sepulchre, and stooping down, he beheld Ninian clothes laid by themselves, and departed, wondering in himself at that which was come to pass. And behold, Two of them went that same day to a village called Emmaus, which was from Jerusalem, about threescore furlongs. And they talked together of all these things which had happened. And it came to pass that while they communed together and reasoned, Jesus himself drew near and went with them. But their eyes were holden, that they should not know him. And he said unto them, What manner of communication are these, that ye have one to another, as ye walk, and are so sad? And one of them, whose name was Cleopas, answering, said unto him, Art thou only a stranger in Jerusalem, and hast not known the things which are come to pass there in these days? And he said unto them, What things? And they said unto him, Concerning Jesus of Nazareth, which was a prophet mighty indeed in the word before God and all the people, and how the chief priests and our rulers deliver him to be condemned to death, and have crucified him. But we trusted that it had been he which should have redeemed Israel, and beside all these, today is the third day since these things were done. Yeah, and a certain women also of our company made us astonished, which were early at the sepulchre, and when they found not his body, they came, saying that 
they had also seen a vision of angels, which said that he was alive. And certain of them which were with us went to the sepulchre, and found it even so, as the women had said, but him they saw not. Then he said unto them, O fools, and the slow of heart to believe all that the prophets have spoken. Ought not Christ to have suffered these things, and to enter into his glory? And beginning at Moses and all the prophets, he expounded unto them in all the scriptures the things concerning himself. And they drew nigh unto the village, whither they went, and he made as though he would have gone further. That's it. Thank you. God bless you.